Okay, don't 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 mind the noise in the background. It's football Sunday. So and 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 my honey's team is playing right now, so we're just gonna ignore the fact that she's yelling in the background. Okay. I'm gonna take out my glasses because I always get a glare. Went to I can't I have to ignore her. Went to Walmart and Dollar Tree, and I love the time when I do Walmart and Dollar Tree, unless they're massive hauls each. I usually put them together because where we go, Dollar Tree is literally next door to Walmart. So I put them together. We're gonna do Walmart first. Um, so let me show you guys what they what we got. Y'all know I love my moo's. They are my favorite, my nightgowns that I get from uh Walmart. They have their Christmas ones out, and I literally want them all. The Christmas ones are so stinking cute. If you guys remember me hauling the Halloween one, I got the ghost one, and I love it. Love it. It didn't have pockets. For some reason, they made it without pockets, but all my other moo-moos have pockets, and I checked while we were in Walmart. The Christmas ones have pockets as well, so... Here it is. See the pocket? But I got this one. I love the plaid. It says cheers on it. So stinking cute. And I get small, medium. This is the smallest that you can get. And they fit me really, really well. So, and I'm four, I'm 4'10", 120 pounds. So in case you guys are curious as to like kind of sizing, this is perfect for me. Um, the small, medium. And then next up. We grabbed these PJs for my son's Christmas Eve box because the toddler pajamas are already out and they're going to sell out. So I just grabbed these. I absolutely, I love this. Just a little basic plaid. Like, I think this is so, so stinking cute. And it was $5.44 for the um, little plaid jammies. And I get him, I always get him a size, a size up for him. Um, so he fits in them a little bit longer. But that's what we got there. Um, next up, we got some potato chips, the wavy ones. Um, we got a nice big thing of eggnog. Babe and I both love eggnog. I'm so happy that's back in stores. Uh, our cats needed some more treats. So they love the, the catnip ones are their favorite. So we got them the catnip ones. We got a like, bunch of like snacky foods for today because we already ate lunch and that's so like this, when we get hungry we'll be like just snacking that's what we normally do on football sunday most of the time unless i'm doing like a crock pot meal we really don't eat a big meal on sundays we just literally do like snacks um some buttery round crackers it's just walmart brand of ritz crackers okay we got some um pre-sliced hard salami um, two things of Munster cheese. It's my, one of my favorites and babe loves it as well. And then babe got a Swiss. I don't eat Swiss, but it's okay. Um, I got some chocolate chips because I plan, if I don't do it today, I do plan on making, um, banana chocolate chip cookies within the next couple days. Um, pepperonis. We got a French onion dip. And then I'm already down two creamers. Um, so I got two more of the Grinch frosted sugar cookie creamer. It's my favorite. Nicole loves it. So we always, always have backups in the freezer that we store because I can't do without it. So next up from Dollar Tree, we did not get a lot. Um, I didn't even have plans to go to Dollar Tree today. Nicole just went there. So I was like, all right, we'll look. Um, I grabbed this Sure Fresh container and lid. It is for deviled eggs. Um, and I mostly got it because I do make deviled eggs a lot. But with Thanksgiving coming up as well, I always make deviled eggs. So I wanted a container to actually hold them. It does have a little handle. The only thing that I'm going to say is make sure 
if you go grab this from Dollar Tree, these were right next to each other, but just in case they're not, make sure you're grabbing the bottom and the, the lid because they come separate. You have to put them together, but they do just scan the lid because if you look at the box that they're in, it says two piece for the dollar twenty five. So that's meaning the lid and the bottom. Um, just in case like you don't know that. Um, just look out for that because they do come together. Okay. We also oh sorry, this is from Walmart as well. This is a uh Smarty Cat scratch knot spray um for your furniture. We don't like our cats scratching our furniture regardless, but we just got brand new furniture not even a week ago. So we keep, we, I spray it down. Um, these were in the craft section, but and I've never seen them by Crafter Square, but they actually are for Nicole. She's going to use them as, and just put them in her toolkit, but they are pliers. So I've never seen those before. Those are for her. And then I've been wanting to try this Crafter Square roller cutter out. A lot of people have been telling me that this is actually really, really good. So I'm going to give it a go. Excuse me. See how I feel about it. We got a Surefresh pack of 15. Um, these are freezer? Yeah, freezer quart bags. <clears throat> um, I got a pack of uh 35 scented they say kitchen bags these are mountain air um but i'm going to use them for the bathroom um our bathroom garbage can they had different scents as well i just got another bliss text uh it just says medicated berry chapstick because uh yeah mm -hmm. where we live it, it's starting to get cold and my lips chap and let me tell you guys we're expecting snow showers today. Even if it's not snow showers, we're expecting snow flurries. And it's only what? What is today's date? The 22nd of October. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I got this little freaking container. I could not say no to it with the gingerbreads and the gumdrops and the snow and the candy canes. Like, it's just life. Um, the lid does come off. It's just taped down right now, but I'm actually going to put this in the middle of my dining room table to ha house like little like candies and stuff. Cause we don't eat a lot of candy in this house. Um, but every now and then like TMI, but girls, let me know if you feel me when it's your time of the month, you're craving chocolate or you're coming up on that time. I like to keep chocolate for Nicole and I, because most of the time that's how we can tell we're getting ready for mother nature to visit us. But yeah, I like to keep the jar a jar of like chocolate and then lastly i was so excited about these couple finds right here um so babe we we're looking at the coloring books and i'm gonna like my son always gets a coloring book in his christmas stocking and he always gets one in his christmas eve box um but i didn't think anyone let them like took brought them out yet we did find one for him i actually grabbed a christmas coloring book for myself i'll show you guys but babe next to like literally on the same shelf as the they were on an end cap of the christmas eve of the christmas um coloring books i'm sorry was this book and it's called twas the night before christmas and i do my i don't think my son has this book yet um and any other from any place else but look at this look at these illustrations i don't remember dollar tree ever like they might have had a twas the night before christmas book before but i never remember it being this one these illustrations are to die for they are so so beautiful look at him look how happy he looks he's so cute um yeah so we got him that and then in like the same box there was i saw it looked like a different cover i saw this one and this one is a christmas story and i was just like um yes my son needs that. So we got him this one as well. Like same thing. These illustrations are just absolutely beautiful. Like these are stunning. I love them. Absolutely love them. So we got those. And then y'all check your Dollar Trees. If you guys like get your kids like coloring books for like the different holidays and seasons. 
or if you just like to color yourself and make sure you're looking in the boxes for different ones because they have the display ones that are in the front of each box but if you like look in them like behind each coloring book usually there's different styles so i found a disney one and it had like the disney princesses and then there was marvel in there and then hiding in there was the mickey mouse one so if i hadn't gone looking behind the one that was on display i would have never seen that they had mickey mouse and my son loves mickey mouse this is um, a coloring and activity book. So this is either going to go in his Christmas stocking or it's going to go in his Christmas Eve box. Haven't quite decided yet, but yeah, he loves Mickey Mouse and he loves to color and we color with him. So, oh my gosh, look at it. How cute is he? Uh, and then for myself, and they did have three or four different ones of these. I've never, I, unless I just don't remember, I've never seen Dollar Tree put out Grinch coloring books. Grinch coloring books. And they had like three or four different ones. And I did check the scent, like the insides and they were, they looked like different photos. So I think each coloring book is different. I skimmed through them quickly. So maybe they weren't, but they did, they did look like they were all different. I love that. So this one is definitely for me. Mm -hmm. I don't have a, a Christmas themed adult coloring book yet. So I was like, this one would be perfect. So literally that's it. That's everything. That's everything. Wasn't, wasn't too bad.